Okay, so here it is. Um, I've only probably done this once before, but uh, putting it together and such, but you can remove the seat completely by taking this off and that makes it pretty short or and you put the seat someplace else or you can just shove it all the way down like this and that also makes it pretty short but you've got the you got the backrest sitting up here so let's just say we take it off okay and then it folds pretty easy uh, but it doesn't stand up by itself when you do just remove this latch here and then you have to steer the front wheel and get the pedals just right uh, and it folds all the way up to right here and that's the completely folded position so let me see if I can prop this thing up so it stands up and I can take some measurements for you let's prop it up on the seat there how's that Okay, let me get some, let me get a tape measure and make some measurements. Oh, and I forgot, you also have this. Um, let's see, how do you do this? You, uh, haven't done this since I, oh, this is, you pull it up, I guess. It's not as difficult as I'm making it look. <laughs> um, let's see here. So the handles also fold down onto themselves like that. And so that's, I mean, it makes a pretty compact package for as large of a bike as it is. I'd say that the length probably ends up being under four feet. Let me go check that side real quick, see how close I am. Looks like, looks like it's pretty close. Yeah, right there. And then with this folded in, not counting the seat, looks like it's about 40 inches long. And the top, the height is, is going to be 31 inches, as tall as it goes, and the width is going to be, uh, let's call it three feet. So those are the dimensions, I sure hope that helps.